Hello everybody and welcome back to my Gondor Let's Play Part 21! So, uh, I ended the turn just so you guys wouldn't have to see that and uh, yeah, uh, this orc army has come up to attack me now. So, yeah, we're being besieged there but no other army has come to really help us there so I can just use Boromir to take them down or attack that city. Like in all honesty, I could attack the city with this garrison unit here and see what I could do. Um, which I think I might do actually, because I have no other threat. So Boromir can go and take that army, and we can I'm take out. Stick you. What I'll do is I'm gonna take this army out, and I'm gonna fight this battle. The and they don't want to fight. Okay. 295 men, and it's two archer units or three archer units. No, two scout units, an archer unit, and a ballista. Okay. We are yeah, we can take that garrison without anybody being an Oskilia. And then we can just use Boromir to clean up the small army over here. Uh, Captain Naslag, okay, he's got like no men. But I would rather fight this battle and take him out losing no men because as was Gondor, I need as much men as possible. However, um, it shouldn't be a long battle anyway, so I'll try and make it as fast as I can. So I will see you guys on the battle map. Okay, so I'm going to just start the deployment. No need to really keep these guys waiting. Um, so I will make this battle a longer battle again. If you guys, I don't know, have an issue with me be ha having these battles or these parts so long, do tell me because I can make them shorter. Like, normally when it gets to 20, 25 minutes, I normally think that's, I don't know, too long to be playing a part like this. So uh, maybe I should cut it down a little bit. But oh well. All I want to do is just take these guys out fast and quick. So, uh, can't believe I didn't group these guys. What are they again? Or graders, spear band, and scouts. Okay. I'm gonna rush my men up and then rush my cavalry round and just attack them from the back, as I usually do, as I usually do. So, uh,. And just really fire and let loose on these these units here. To be honest, yeah, this shouldn't be that fast. And we'll get them out of spear wall. Just rush these guys in. And these are scouts. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my cavalry behind them. Just smack them in the face. I have another unit. A couple of units there. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to charge my men in before they can get any kind of attack. And I'm just going to send my men in for a hammer and anvil. So, before these guys can get any shots into me, or anything like that, I'm just gonna route them. Route them from the field. There we go, they're already done. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Just kill them like that. Orc spear band, we're taking very minimal losses. Ooh, we're taking some cav you know, cav casualties. Oh. The enemy general fighting to the death. Like the coward he is. Press on with him. Break the spirit of his army. Okay, basically we've won this battle already. Only I don't really. Enemy force remains. I don't really see what else we're doing here. I'm gonna send my scouts out before they get killed, and I'm sending my Dol Amroth squires out as well, because casual cavalry do really bad against spearmen, as you guys know. We've lost. 2% of our army. Get them in for a hammer and anvil. Or or spear band will take them out. I'm just sending all my men in just so because the, the more men we can get in there, the more they can route. The enemy army flees. Okay, so that's us done now. So I'm what I'm gonna do is 
I will cut this part out until I kill them all, just so I don't waste as much time. So I shall see you guys on the result screen. Okay, so uh, we can see the clear victory battle screen and we can see the stats. We lost 28 men in that battle, so casualties sustained are Doll Armour Squires, so that's my cavalry. We lost quite a bit of cavalry. 2% uh, of our men's nothing. Anyway, I shall see you guys on the campaign map where we will continue our uh, endeavors. Okay, so um, we're going to execute them. Now remember this day. And we'll send these guys what? out. And basically, Fox. we'll send these guys back to Sirith Ungol. And I wonder if I can do anything yet. I can't recruit anything or do anything like that. This army will take over Fox there. Boromir will come help them. Uh, we, we have a spy here to see if, if, if guys are coming towards us. Plus, I'm just going to recruit as much men as I can to protect Kara Andros, etc, etc. And I can race men across if anything goes wrong. We have some arch units and some Gondir Pike. Gondir. Gondir? Gondir. Gondir pikemen, I mean. <laughs> and now we finally have a, an army here. Enough for... Enough for the, like, ooh, Dol Amroth archers. We have some here, actually. Two archer units, some guardsmen. I was gonna pick up a unit from here. Now there's two armies here. So they're wanting us to take this this place solemnly without their help, and, which is good, I suppose. And then we've also got some of these two guys here. Interesting. Ships riding. Mining naval so, forces. I wanna pop all these guys in here. And we're gonna take this army down here so it can meet up with one of our other armies. And while I do that, again, I'm gonna need more units to come join us here. I wish I could recruit more uh, of a... Oh no, we've got enough men there. We've got enough men here to attack us. So, who are we gonna attack with? Are we gonna attack with these guys? You have... Let's see what their army is composed of. They've got two ballistas. They've got no archer units, which is great, because it means I can just sit in and fire at them. And then we've got two archer units here. I'm going to pop them in this army here. And then I'm going to attack them with this army. So we've got another battle for you. It seems like all I ever do in this campaign is battle, so I might as well. So we're going to attack them from two sides, which is great. Gassan, which is uh, an enemy general, which I'll love to take out. He's got the same amount of stars as my guy, Dwarven the Merciless. So we are going to attack them, and the balance of power is 2 to 1, so we should win this no problem. We've got more men than them, and our men are of better quality. So anyway, I will see you guys on the battle map, where we will kill these guys pretty fast, I hope. So yeah. Alright, so I'm back. Let's start the deployment, and let's go ahead with this glorious battle. And I just plugged in my phone, so hopefully it won't interrupt my gameplay. Alright. Hello, Grey Marines. You guys are going to sit on the front line. You're going to be group one. And then I'm going to have my archers behind them as group two. And then I want my weakest unit on the ram, which is actually already there, which is great. And I want my spearmen. My spearmen in. Here, I group them, and then we have these guys up here. Group them, and then my cavalry. I'm gonna group these two units and keep my general close for morale support. The only problem I have at the moment is there are these towers of Harad, and so I'm gonna put my men on loose formation. And there we go. Let's start the battle. Put them in. And then I want to move my... To be honest, if they're not going to come out to me, I'm not going to keep my men close to them. Like, where are my allies coming from? Yeah, of course they're not coming in from a fucking valuable side. They're coming in from the... Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. They're coming in from the west. The southwest for me. And what's hilarious is that they've not made the unit with the battering ram come in. They've made the unit, the other units come in, including cavalry, which I don't need. Okay. What a useless AI. Dear lord. 
Like, if they bring their Hadrim Spearmen in, I want to make this a long-winded battle, because when I play online, the main objective is obviously to win. When you're playing a campaign like this, your main objective is to win, but with as much men, um, without as the least amount of casualties you can. So, I, I don't know. I, I have to be a lot smarter when I play on a campaign in some sense. Like, of course I could go all out and be completely careless. Like, I've done that before uh, in numerous battles, but I tend to not want to because it means that my gameplay is not as smooth. Or the way I want to play, it's not as smooth. Right, I'm bringing in my um, my archers in because they're bringing their spearmen closer. Like, I think this Gondor militia will just die, but it doesn't matter. And I keep bloody well not grouping them. Okay, in we go. What's good is that. No oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. It's okay, man. Just come in from the side. Let them come towards us. See, when I start firing at them, they don't come towards me. <laughs> when I stop firing, they come towards me. But now they're like, uh, no, no, let's just. What are we gonna do? I don't know what the AI is planning. I don't know what's happening with this ballista. Oh, yes. Come off that fire at will, please. Why, thank you. Okay, fire archers into them. Come on, men, show them what you're made of. I want all my arrows to be used. Because I'm going to have to kill all of them. So the more men I can kill now, the better. And they're running towards us. Hooray! Hopefully they realize what they're doing by coming out towards us. Because my men are sitting here, right ready to come in. Where is my hype men? Oh, well, they're coming out to fight us. They're coming out. Oh, hooray. They're just going to be battered. Okay, um, let's stop these guys. You guys can come in and fire from the side, I think. You guys can continue to fire like that. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh dear lord. How I did not see that. Oh wow, I can't believe they sent their general out to certain doom like this. Oh wow, our squires are going to be just destroyed. Please start dying. Okay, well, we're, we're gonna win that fight now because there's three of us. I did not realize they were doing that. They're okay, they've routed. Um, and they. Okay, let's tell them to stop. And then put our missiles on them. They've already routed. Interesting. And how's our generals doing? Yeah, okay, well, we've completely destroyed them now. I was a bit worried there, because normally the Harad's general... Alright, oh, I thought we killed him there. Normally our, the enemy general is quite strong. And he was, he killed two of my men. Our men have captured the enemy general. Guard him well and make it so he can see us defeat the rest of his army. Oh god, come out, please. Oh dear. Our archers are firing into them. Building lost the gateway. 
the lone doll Amroth pikeman as he fights them off. He's gonna be killed in a second. I know he is. Um. Right. Uh, did he die? No, he didn't. Oh no, he did. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh dear lord. You guys better run. I'm gonna have my men in there. Now it's just getting my bloody men into the fucking place. Oh glory. Um. They've got all their cavalry here. I really do not want their cavalry coming into my men at all. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Yes, we will. It's all been calculated. Oh, for the love of God! I swear, if they're on, yeah, there you go. I always forget the servo uh, skirmish mode. I know it's like a really good mode. Enemy general fallen. We captured him. We're gonna kill him. I'm not gonna let any of their generals uh, be alive until the are dead. Come on, just die, run away or something. Run away! Hurry up! Oh, there's more of them coming in. <sighs> they're, they're, they're putting up a good fight. They're putting up a really good fight, actually. They're not dying. Dear lord. Okay, I killed one of them. Hmm, interesting. That's just... Oh dear lord, just rout, please! Finally, dear lord! gonna be a longer battle because we have to I don't know siege them out where are they going I hate sieges they're already broken again these guys are already I don't know wanting to rout Our men are kind of like, I don't know, finding it hard to get in. I'm going to let my archers fire. I'm going to take one of my generals in as well. I'm just worried about these guys. Those are my main concerns. They're, apart from them, they're not going to be able to do anything. I feel, kind of feel like I want to edit half of this though, because a lot of it's been quite mediocre, but that's okay. The video will be long. I suppose I'll end it after this, or I'll get one or two, two more things done. Like, these guys are already routing. Or wavering, even, sorry. Some of them are routed. There we go. 22 of them. Oh, wow. Oh, no, they're all routing. Run, men, run! Oh, my archers fire. Fire, men! They're just gonna, they're gonna come back and forth until we kill them all. Wow. They're just, they're routing and just coming back. 
what I'd really like is as soon as they route and my men can just push through and kill them all, like, well, actually, we're kind of doing that. Kind of. I don't know. As long as we don't have any more surprises. Any more horrible surprises like we have been going. Like, I want my spearmen to fight off their cavalry. Killed 36% of our men. We've killed almost like nothing of them. I like how our archers are doing though. They're doing some damage to the back of their men, which is kind of what we want. Weaken their outside support. And then I'm going to use one of my cavalry. Attack one of their cavalry units. Hear the sound of Gondor. Rally. I'm just going to speed this up a little bit. We're doing fine. Putting up a decent fight, though. Slowly pushing into them. I'll let you guys see the fight here. They're wavering, but the thing is, they can't really. They're being pushed back so much. And our archers. Wow, my archer units has run out already. Yes, we're killing some of their cavalry as well. And there's some. Some Lancer units there. Oh, what's glorious is if we can take out this unit here and they stay there. If I can force my men into a wedge here. If these units start to route, they're going to route into my men and thus die. Which will be a great thing. Oh, my poor cavalry units. Make every shot count. Yes. Oh, you don't have any more shots then. Look, they've got little short swords. That's awesome. Our arrows make every shot count. only problems with our archers are they're volunteers. Right, I'm going to speed it up again. Just so we can get this done. Whittle down the men. Kill them all. I think this will be a long video. I'm, I'm thinking in the half an hour category. Okay. Whoa. Uh, 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 come back here. What are you guys doing at the front of my army? At least, have I got spearmen at the front? Oh dear lord. I should have pulled some men in from the other flanks. I'm gonna see what it's gonna be like to put in two units into these Hadrim spearmen who are facing the. No, they're not facing the right way. So let's see. Generals, please do some damage. Okay, we've killed a lot of them. Wow, we're doing really well. But their um, morale's not dropping like I expected. Pull them out a bit. Oh wow, they got out as well. <laughs> That's interesting. Managed to kill a lot of them there. Come out, please. And then I want to pull these guys to here. Might as well hammer and anvil them from all sides while the horsemen are intact. We've lost 17% of our men. Ooh, we're losing quite a bit of men now, actually. Come on. In we go. The thing is, the, the problem is, we're not. they're not even, like, in order. They're... 
We're hitting them from the side. Wow, we hit them with everything there, actually. Only half the enemy force remains. I can't believe they're not routed yet. Come on. We killed about a hundred of them. Wow, that's really decent. Okay, right. I'm gonna pull my men out again and do another charge into them. Because they're pulling out their southern lancers and then they're pulling them back in. Southern lancers are doing hard. Oh no, they're doing quite well. Dear lord. Hmm. Like we're gonna win. Not as well as I wanted to. Come on. Right, they're still not in the right position. They're wavering. They're broken! Haha! <laughs> and there we go. That's how we take down a spear unit from the front. Okay, we'll pull our men out again. Let these solemn seven men do whatever the hell they want, and we're gonna attack the southern warband now. Okay. Into the southern warband, we go! Because look, they're not even facing the right bloody way. We might as well run into them. Now, only now do they come in the right way. And I'm in. much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Okay, my men are doing good. Men are doing good. Okay, can you guys just come out of this fight, please? Because you're not even... No, run! Please, there we go. Can you guys stop it? Do as you're told. Well, I was going to hope for them to come out to me. But it's okay. They're gonna be like that, they can be like that. They're still not facing the right way. And now they've lost about 10 men, hopefully. Yeah, they lost about 10 men. Right, now come on, draw our men out. That's why having Bob General's bodyguards are so good. Don't do that. Don't be silly, Southern Warband. Okay. I'm just gonna attack him now. kind of bringing my men in and out of <laughs> A long-winded battle this has become. We're just warmed up. Oh, the horse in this, like the horse cavalry in this game is just so fucking slow. So slow. Just go into them and there we go. Now that they've routed, just push him back. Come 
That's how we do it. All our cavalry's gone. We only lost like what 30% of our men. Woo, that's that's not a good number. Hopefully we'll have uh, sustained some of these injuries. Why are we taking losses? The southern lancers are killing us. Okay. There we go. They're not gonna last much longer. I mean, sausage didn't from all angles. And we will have taken this place. Thank fuck. Ah, there we go. This Let's end them now. Victory. Dear lord. Okay. So that was a clear victory. Not as much of a victory as I wanted. We lost almost 600 men. That's ridiculous. All our units took a heavy beating. And we got some casualties healed. We got about 100 men healed. I, uh, well, not 100. 50. 50 men healed. Oh, well. It's fine. We'll have to deal with it. But at least we have another place back again. And I learned my lesson with him. Oh, dear lord. It's the fact yeah. that we're fighting them out in the in a siege. That's why we did so Shall bad there. I'm going to uh, sack the place. Yes, yeah. my lord. And then I I'm gonna... waste words on you. I don't know. I, I, w I don't know if they're gonna come siege me or not. Uh, put my army together, and I'm gonna mix my men up. Because. Okay, well, I can't mix and match them, apparently. Mm-hmm. That's four places. That's five. Your will, my lord. Splitting the troops. Forward. Can I hire anybody with him? No. Yeah, that'll be the garrison unit. <laughs> oh my god, we've got eight of them. That's hilarious. Oh, these little eight little men. There we go. Orders. We'll make camp here. Uh, I can't really retrain anything here. Ships ready. Countrymen. And apart from that, we're doing really well. This is Mordor's army up here. They've got a small force here. Boromir, Lord Boromir, the Merciless, can can come and fight there, I suppose, or come down here. Mr. Phil has some guys. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm making some proper stuff here. Practice range. Right, so this has been a really long part, I'm thinking. But anyway, we did a lot of useful stuff in here. I can start making more men for Dal Amroth. I'm just gonna keep making men here. Because the more men I can bring closer to here, the better. I'm gonna pull my spy up. Hadrim Spearmen, Corsairs, and two fucking units of cavalry. Same here again, two units of cavalry. I hate having cavalry. Whoops, I ended the turn. Right, I'll end the turn and then I'll end it. The part. Let's just hope nothing big happens in it, this part. I'm gonna take. No. Mordor aren't doing anything yet, so that's fine. Bring Lord Mor Boromir the Merciless down to here. To war, then. Beginning the siege. I will maintain the siege. The siege. And then we'll bring these guys to Sirith Ungol. I can't make any of these guys for ages. What does it have in it? I have a barracks. No, I have a yeah, I have a barracks. I can make I can make all these units. Hmm, interesting. What's going on here? Has anything bad gone here? No. Ready. Holy shit! They will not waste words on you. They have combined to make one giant army with like four units. Holy crap! But again, they don't have a general, so that's like a big routing army ready. To happen. Your will, my lord. By your command, 
we can go no further today. I really need to retrain some stuff. Ships ready. All we need to do is bring our men to Umbar. I'm pretty sure the the city's there, Ships so I don't ready. know. I don't know whether to pick up some men here and put them there or As you or wish. what. March to exhaustion, continuing later. But I think I think having a big city there would help. So I think I'm gonna take the coast first and, and move through that way. I need like a third army to help me. That's where Lord Boromir comes in to help. Or maybe I should take this place first. No, no. I'll move along, I'll move along. And then my army here can help me. Okay, anyway, this has been a really long part. I'm sorry it dragged on a lot. Uh, I will keep you updated for the next part. I'll be playing quite a lot of this game, so hopefully I'll get another part to you, to you soon. As I said before, my kind of upload schedule has been quite horrendous in a sense because uh, I'm not in college at the moment and all the recording time I have and uploading time I have is like during the night. So, but yeah, anyway, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back to bring you more of some content soon.